love all the people you know who's been helping you. Don't forget them. Don't forget where you came. Your family. Mm-hmm. Yeah, don't forget where you came from. You know, especially for me, it's very important for me because I'm Filipino, mm-hmm. and it's very important. Important for me, the culture, you know, my people, Filipinos, they're so, so important for me. And I just can't, you know, just go here and forget them. So yeah. I think that's very important. Just don't forget where you came from. Great advice. Um, we've got time for a few more. <laughs> um, here's one from Liva Millis. I think that's right, Liva Millis. Out of all the places you've been to so far, which is your favorite and why? Okay. Um, that's hard. Las Vegas. Vegas. Mm-hmm. Wow. Same and of city. course, New York. <laughs> I love New York. I seriously love New York, but mm-hmm. I'm not really used to the weather. Okay. So, LA is the perfect weather. Yeah, LA is, is much Yeah, but more... I love Ve- Vegas too. Like yeah, those okay. three. What do you like about Vegas? It's fun. Like every everything's <laughs> in there. You know, uh-huh. mini New York. You know, Paris. It's it's fun. Mm-hmm. Right. So you're a big city girl, really. I think, yeah. Right. <laughs> or at least at heart. At least at heart. Um, okay, here's someone from Magnus today. What is the most difficult song for you to perform? Mm, is there one nothing, that's sort of like... There's nothing easy for me. They're all hard. There's nothing easy for you. Hmm. I know. I mean... So, I mean, but what do you mean by that? I, I mean, it's... You know, they're all hard. I think Beyonce's songs are hard to sing, especially okay. when I sing Halo. Mm-hmm. You know, because, you know, it's R&B. Eh, there's mm-hmm. a lot of R&B stuff in there. And I think, you know, that's one of the hardest songs that I'm singing now. And um, my songs, it's kind of hard to <laughs> sing. <laughs> Pyramid, it's pretty hard to sing, you know. Right. Well, you would never know it because you make it look so effortless. I mean, and that's what... No, I'm being serious. I'm, right? I'm being totally serious. No, They're but. not going to answer. <laughs> <laughs> but I guess, that that, I guess that that's part of the... Um, part of what makes you a good performer is that, like, you make the difficult look easy and you make it look, like, really effortless. So Thank you. So, so whatever you're doing, <laughs> it's working. So. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> um, thank you. Here's a question from Jessica. I'm seriously, there's three S's, two I's, two C's, and like four A's. Um, How many instruments can you play and which which ones? Do you play any instruments? I play a little bit of piano, guitar. Um, I used to to play violin. Island, but no, I I stopped playing it. Okay. Um, just for mess- fun, I just love love playing drums. Mm-hmm. The drums, really? Yeah. Okay. I mean, not great, but. Mm-hmm. You know. And do you still play like piano and guitar? Guitar, like, you, um, yeah. yeah, more guitar. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. Cool. Um. C Oblique wants to know, how do you keep yourself fit and how do you take care of your voice? <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> well, um, You're going to say, you don't work out at all. It's like, yeah. oh, it's just, I just wake up, I eat whatever I want to, it just comes naturally, right? Well, um... <laughs> Be real. <laughs> yeah, that's why I don't know what to say. <laughs> well, um... Uh, well, my about my voice. Um, yeah. Okay. Because <laughs> I don't think one. I'm fit, but um. Stop it. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> about my voice. Um, uh-huh. you know, like if there's a time, just rest. You know, um, sleep. Mm-hmm. That's because you know sometimes you know um. Sometimes you have to like stay up late for you know like some schedule you have to stay up late and that's not good for the voice. So right. if there's time, at least like sleep for like eight hours. Oh, that's really important okay. for the voice. Water. Is there? A sp- mm-hmm. I was gonna say, is there a special sort of concoction that you drink? Like just if water. You, just just water. Mm, just water. You don't have like a honey tea or no. any sort of no. like no special. No. Okay. And just. Don't ask. I mean, about you know, like, I'm not fit. Yeah, okay, we, we believe you, sir. <laughs> I'm not fit, but thanks, though. No, some, hey, some of it just have it easy. Some of just have it easy. 
you don't have to don't don't, don't apologize for being fabulous it's fine <laughs> <laughs> you're funny but uh, i mean thanks for saying that but i'm not uh, i'm gonna say that again i'm not fit <laughs> <laughs> she's not fit don't ask her we all know um okay um just a few more questions amy Amy Gravy, yeah, Amy Gravy says, uh, have you thought about writing a book about your life challenges and blessings? Oh, I mean, why not? I mean, I haven't done anything like that, but that's a great idea. And um, it's just, you know, I think I I just have to wait for the right time to do that, Mm -hmm. you know. Somewhere in between law school and... You know, know, I think, I mean, there's a lot of things that I want to share for everybody, but Mm -hmm. I still want to, you know go further and you know do more things and if i feel like okay this is it i want to share everything to all of them then right. that's it because i think this is not the right time yet right right mm-hmm. still more to go and uh when you get around to writing your memoir be sure to uh to give a credit to amy gravy for yes yes for definitely. Inspiring amy that. amy <laughs> gravy <laughs> um nalika, nalika tan says what is your favorite christmas song my grown-up christmas list your my grown up Christmas list. Mm-hmm. Okay, I don't think I know that. Do song. you remember me? I sat upon your knee. I wrote to you with childhood fantasies. Well, I'm all grown up now. Can you still help somehow? I'm not a child, but my heart still can dream. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Don't cry. <laughs> <That was laughs> no, seriously, yeah. that, was, that was so sweet. Thank you. That was so sweet. Um, and thank you for doing that for us. No, I appreciate that. Um, I have to compose My myself here now. <laughs> um, okay, last question. Last question. Hey, Cherise has. I'm sorry. This is from Cubby fifty fifty one fifty. Um, hey, Cerise, has there been anything about fame stardom that has really surprised you? You know, I think a lot of people, you know, they'll daydream about what it is to be famous and what it is to be like a big celebrity. Um, you know, now that you're here, is it really like, is it what you expected it to be? Is there anything that's completely caught you, caught you off guard? Well, first of all, um, I'm still, you know, I mean, I mean I'm still not used to you know all the things that, that has been happening to you know to my life right now mm-hmm. and um you know because my dream of course is to be recognized by the people and um it's just funny sometimes that you know like when i walk around like you know they just they don't care but then when i start saying they're like i i don't realize you're Cherise. i mean you're so tiny <laughs> you're so tiny and in television you're so tall i'm like Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, so, you know, it's, it's you know, I mean, I love being recognized in the Philippines, but, you mm-hmm. know, it's it's different here. It feels great, you know, to be recognized by other, you know, um, like Americans, you know, especially other Asians like Koreans, you know, and all that. It, it feels great. And it surprises me every time, you know, they come just come up with me and say, you know, like, you know, I did a great job, just continue singing. It's it's amazing. You right. know, still. Fantastic. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, thank you so much for joining us. It's been thank great you. to talk to you, and thank you for all the songs and for tugging on my heartstrings. Um, my pleasure. Thank you. Okay, so so once again, we are going to look for you on Glee some point before the end of season two. Sunshine's making a comeback. We'll yep. see how it goes. Um, you're working on a new album. Yes. Any idea when we can hear new material from you? Just watch out for it. Just watch out for that <laughs> as well. And uh, you can definitely tune in tomorrow night for the tree lighting yes. ceremony in Rockefeller mm-hmm. Center where Cherise will be performing next to Mariah Carey, Josh Groban, and many others. So thank you once again. Thank, uh, you. thank you for watching at home. And be sure to come back tomorrow where you can see not only the archive of this interview, but you'll see behind the, s- <laughs> you'll see behind the scenes footage um, from this interview. Maybe a little single ladies. We'll see. Um, you'll download it using the AT&T Code Scanner app using http scan.mobi from your mobile device and you will be able to unlock all sorts of great content so once again Cherise thank you so much it's thank been a you. pleasure thank you for, thank you for watching and we'll see you next time